Welcome back to Living Local TV. When you're in the mood for a low-calorie dish that's loaded with lots of flavor, try a simple mix of mango and mahi. And here to show you how is our musical chef, JJ. Aloha, and welcome back to Living Locale on Living Local. I'm Chef JJ Reinhardt, and today I'm gonna to prepare a nice dish that's gonna incorporate a lot of different flavors with some different herbs, as well as some very, very unique vegetables. Uh, we're starting with mahi-mahi, so I'm gonna do a roasted mahi-mahi dish. One of my favorite vegetables is actually spaghetti squash, so we're gonna talk a little bit about that with a chermulia sauce, which is from uh, Northern Africa, and a mango chutney. So what we're going to do is start off with a little bit of macadamia nut oil in our pan. We're gonna start with our aromatics. Now a chutney is typically based off of fruit, and it's, but it's, it's sweet and savory. So um, our Eva sweet onions, a little bit of chopped garlic, of course our Hawaiian ginger that has a great, great flavor to that. And I like to use a lot of ginger in this one because it's, it's gonna really drive a lot of flavor uh, and it pairs really well with that mango. Next up, I like to add a little bit of tomato. Again, like I said, a chutney is both sweet and savory. We start to cook down our tomatoes. I'm using coriander and a little bit of cumin. Then I'm using, uh, it's a locally made Hawaiian chili pepper salt. So I like to have a little bit of that heat in my chutney. I'm gonna stir this just a little bit. Next, we're gonna add our mangoes. These are nice and ripe. Really gonna bring out a lot of that sweet flavor. Uh, we're gonna start caramelizing a lot of the sugars in there and just a little bit of lime juice. As well as I've got some local oranges. Now these are from the Big Island. They're known as hippie oranges. They've got a really nice flavor. We're gonna let this cook down because I wanna concentrate all of the flavors of this and so it kind of all molds together. Now the next Thing we're gonna have is I, I've actually pre-made this chermulia sauce. Now what chermulia is, is it's a blend of equal parts cilantro and parsley. It also has garlic, ginger, a little bit of cumin, and some uh, chili peppers. I'm using sambal in this one. Just take, add everything raw into the blender and blend it up. So this is gonna give us a really nice color sauce. It's got a great depth of flavor. Next up, spaghetti squash. Now I love spaghetti squash. The easiest way to cook this a little bit of water, salt and pepper, wrap it in plastic and put it in the microwave. For a half of a squash about this size, it's about nine minutes in the microwave. When it comes out, you can just take your fork and shred really, really easily. As my sauce is cooking down, I'm just gonna start plating this up. I do have a ring mold today because I actually wanna control how I'm gonna put this on the plate. Got that right on there. I've got my mahi-mahi. I'm just gonna put that right on top of there. And I'll go back to my chutney. That's gonna go right on top of this fish. Beautiful flavor, beautiful color. I wanna add cilantro for garnish. I always like a little extra heat. So I've got some Fresno chilies, tiny little bit of that. Again, a little bit of our fresh tomatoes. So we've got two different textures, but a lot of color, a lot of flavor. And there you have it and roasted mahi-mahi, chamoya sauce, and spaghetti squash with a puri mango chutney. Now this is what I call living locale. Aloha.